Good afternoon. I'd like to show you this uh, rejuvenation system, is what they call it. Um, it's a really, really, really nice blender. Um, it actually has this little grommet, so that it's pretty easy to clean. You don't actually have to lock it down or spin it, because these actually keep it in place. And it's got that safety mechanism right there. But it's very simple. You simply take them off. Fresh grommet, so that's good. Um, it's got a large, large capacity. What is it? Two liters, a two liter capacity, which is huge. Um, it's got this, um, I would say processor or like pusher. So that way everything always stays down like you need it to. It's very basic. You have power. Um, you have pulse. Never do that with the lid off unless there's nothing in it. Um, you actually control the speed, which is really nice. That way you don't have different levels. You just control it yourself. And then you actually have a timer too. So if you're just trying to stir it or something like that, you can keep it and you can keep the timer on, which is super nice. But I will kind of show you how it goes. So I'm going to start... I like to start with the actual substrate first, or fruit. Ooh, perfect test. I got a huge block of fruit. Coming out. There you go, huge block of fruit. So, got that. Make it a little smoothie real quick. I like to do about half to that. Mm -hmm. Don't need a lot, don't need um, two whole liters. You can always put a, a small amount in there. You got the lid. Which I'm actually going to take off because as you see, if it's not going to get down there or if it's trying to heighten up, I can use this to kind of push it down and that will never get caught by the blade, which is very good. But go ahead and put the lid on and go for it. <laughs> I'll go ahead and set it on. So, timer. So if you want it to slowly churn, or if you're a juicer or something like that, you can always do that. As you can see right there, you can tell that it's not actually hitting anything. Push this down in there. Make sure that all that stuff stays down there. Oh, okay. Yep. Nope. scared me the dog. Alright, so that's good enough. It's gonna be kind of thick because I didn't put a lot of milk in there, but it should still be good. Trying not to make a mess. There we go. I can actually lift the lid all the way out like that. And nice shake. Put a lot of strawberry and pineapple, so it's a pretty thick shake. But as you see, it definitely mulches everything up, and it definitely gets it all done, and it's a great option. So enjoy, and let us know what you make. 